Yo, Blue, how you doing? I don't know why my camera's always twisted the wrong way. Anyway, um... Happy Memorial Day weekend. Anybody having maybe an extended one? I want to play some Paper Mario Thousand Your Door soon. We're playing the original one on the, uh, the old school GameCube side. Anybody already pick up the, uh, the, the remake? Fancy Switch remake? I, I would. I told everybody I'm saving up though. I'll probably be like, if I, if I decide to play it, we could do like a, a run through enjoy the atmosphere updates and not read all the text because I've already gone through virtually all that. Um, Team Family tomorrow and celebrating your old man's birthday. Oh, well, congrats. Congrats to uh, your old man side there, too. And thanks for the contribution on the points. Um, again, yeah, hello to everybody. Blue, Sky. Not sure if I said blue. Hello, blue. Hello, blue. Yo, blue. Uh, what the heck? 95% complete. Thank you, Irem, for the uh, extra points towards the Modern Games Marathon. So my plan is, towards the end of June, if I don't have a big family get-together, Sky is the best. LOL. You gotta remind me, like, one more time, right? One more time before I'm officially off this island of shame and knowing the wrong name. Look, I've even got my, my doggo, uh... Retro nerd glasses tonight. Hey, <laughs> Blue. Blue Sky with the final touches. Thank you for the points. You guys filled it up 100% already, like 10 days early. Um, but yeah, like I said, I could kick that off early. I might be jumping on some Xbox Series X. Uh, I'm gonna let folks pick. You don't have to waste any more channel points. I'm gonna let folks pick with some polls soon. And the polls might be in the Discord. Resident Evil 4 Remake, Mass Effect, one or two on the Xbox updated Series X version, the Legendary Edition that has 4K graphics. Um, and then the other optional pull would be a uh, Final Fantasy Strangers of Paradise RPG. So uh, there'll be at least four options, and I'm gonna let folks in the Discord actually be the first ones to have like throw the hat in the ring, you know, throw where you would like uh, folks to go. Both good picks, yeah. Oh, and uh, actually, there'll be a fifth title. A fifth title I haven't announced yet, but I wanted to run it through uh, one of my mods. He wanted to see it. But I think I'm going to post as much of that as I can on YouTube as well. Kind of mix it up. Uh, how you doing, Shaman Ninja? Sage, thank you for popping in tonight. I hope everybody's weekend's been all right. Blue sky and friends. We off work tonight. You seen a cute little bunny rabbit? Oh, what? A bunny rabbit? Where'd the rabbit go? Was it safe? Was it just like crossing the road or something? That's awesome. I hope uh, I hope it was a good sign. Uh, you know, wrap up your weekend was all right. Uh, but yeah, again, sorry, doing a quick little tiny bit of shares. Um, I've got myself a, a, a rum and coke. I found this uh, like a, technically like local because it's in our Washington state, but uh, Kraken in like dark rum it was like so the Seattle I think it's the uh, soccer team or maybe it's not Kraken soccer I think it's actually no the Sounders are soccer for Seattle I think it's like their uh, rugby team some bit something hardcore has the Krakens as their main uh, the mascot team release the Kraken right so I have like a release the Kraken like it's the last year's uh, new release rum to try as a rum and coke. Huh? That's super cute. I'm glad you got to come across a, uh, a real bunny wabbit on your way out. Uh, from work, anyway. So we're going to North. Uh, playing some original. Hey, Shaman, the gang is all, all here, right? Yeah, the whole, the whole gang. Uh, I think we're heading to Garmia Tower through the Black Forest, and we've come across one encounter so far. And I hightailed it back with my tail between my legs, and I went and saved it because it was like the end of my stream, the last time I could play this. Um, but yeah, Grandia 2 is up first, and then we might be trying some um, Dark Forest, Black Forest for, name this for a reason, I guess. Um, Black Forest 2. Um... GG's on the catch, Irem and Shaman Ninja, yeah. How's everybody doing for this weekend? Did anybody get an extended day off? 
maybe they were or were not planning. You just happen to have it on on the schedule. Dude, this music is a bop, though. Uh, let's see, we can finish him with a couple hits here, right? Land him. Yeah. Can't go wrong with a little RPG sway. A little RPG uh, heavy evening. Kinda feels like a tutorial one. Originally got to miss out on stuff this weekend, was supposed to help work. Uh, Oh, a convention, like a con convention, that had to catch. Sorry to hear that. Practice if you want to beat me. More than one person can catch single Pokemon? Yes! Yeah, 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 yeah. You can throw hats in the ring, and I've seen like 10, 15 people catch in a really active stream. I mean, sometimes it can be distracting because then everybody's doing Poke Catch, exclamation Poke Catch. Um, Poke Catch with whatever balls, you know? Balls sound like you'd be the right ones to catch. 50 G sitting on the ground, huh? The gill. I feel like a wolf in the distance. Seems like an easy spot to get lost in. I know I'm going backwards a little bit, but I feel like there might be a secret. Oh, no, that's back to the start. Okay. I feel like that's a secret exit. Oh, just secret items. Myriad power nut. No. I'm expecting that. I don't know what those other controls do. That start brings us our main menu. Wild Pokemons. Poke Catch is treated like throwing into a horde. Yeah, right? Yeah, and then you can get multiple uh, folks catching it based on whatever your luck is. Plus one attack level for some allies. Oh, it's like to use in battle only. Plus one attack. Cool. Did I ever equip some of the extra accessories I was going for? I don't think I did. Change. Oh, heavy stone, but you lose a little bit of move. Knoll's knockback. Huh. I like move speed so far, I guess. Is it that plus four defense or plus five defense difference? Uh huh. I think I'll try this, because I need all the defense I can get, I guess. Um, but yeah, we got Pokemon Community Games, we got lots of other options too. Thank you guys for being here, and again, you filled like a crazy amount of that goal in less time than I ever have seen. So, appreciate the support. Um, Garmia Tower next. Nice. I think we can only save it in so far, unless we find a new spot to save. Ooh, is like two moons? That's cool. A white and like a little red racing little side moon there. What planet are we on? I mean, power. So there's a little Grandia as a different universe. I feel like they're hiding stuff in like every little cranny here because so far I've seen a couple little secrets. Oh, I am like off the beaten path too. It's like a like a 2D isometric ocarina of time that turned into an RPG. Like you start off in this little foresty area. I feel like a Deku tree temple. Anybody doing any busy uh I want to say, like, Memorial Day seems to be popular to, like, barbecues. So how, how's, our, how's the weather where everybody's at? How's the weather where you are at for tomorrow look? I will tell you, today was rather decent. Weather where I'm at, still 61, and it's, like, 9 at night? About 8.40. Got half the, half the humidity in there. So I take it you're the ones who've been waiting for the princess here? I always give him like a snide, like a Gary tone. He seems a protagonist that's almost like kind of a, a self-absorbed dude. Uh, rainy, but we got some sun coming, so it'll be weed whacking and doing barbecue sometime during the next couple days. Nice. Oh, it's, uh, yeah, close. Right, exclamation weather, W-E-A. 
the AGR. If you can check it, there there is a brief cooldown, but you should have the time of like, and not even 20 seconds or something between it. Um, lovely San Diego. We are. You must be the Geohound. I thank you. So that's a Geohound. He gives me the creeps. Like, paused. The rumors speak truly. All the sisters here, huh? Yuck, he's looking this way. Wow, they really do not like it. Silence! Raining on the East Coast, terrible for travel. Oh, dang. It's pretty sunny there too, right? Wait, 61, 61. That's cool. Clear up in Washington, but we got the same weather currently. Uh, Temperature-wise. You're just a little more rainy maybe down on the uh, California side. Yeah, rain is, a, rain is a pretty common thing in Washington. I think we were ranked number one cloudy estate or something. Recently looked up. Come on, get to it. So, like, we brought her here as an escort. So we're Mr. Geo catcher dude. My sisters, I'm ready. I have Mr. Ryoto to thank for bringing me here safely. We've had, like, two encounters. Like, nothing. Not even a ding or a scratch on her. Now, I don't suppose you'll tell me what this is all about. You guys remember the rain forest, to be fair? Yeah. Yeah. Like, the equivalent to, uh, the evergreen national forest taking up 60% of the state. Uh, please wait outside until we finish the ceremony. When it is concluded, you will escort Elena back to the church. We're in the cloud forest. Briodo here. How long you ladies gonna take? It will take some time. This is all I may say. One more thing. Do not enter the tower under any circumstances. The ceremony must not be disturbed by your kind, er, you. Oh, my kind? Right. I'll just sit over here and think filthy, unclean thoughts, then. Please, do not come inside. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> he is such a protagonist. He is like the a-hole of the protagonist. Always wanted to go hiking through there. Yeah, honestly, uh, the Centennial Trail that runs like a couple different states. I want to say it might even run like four or so states in the north end of the Pacific Northwest. Um, is beautiful. Like if anybody ever wants to go up hiking or biking, there's some pretty amazing trails. Um... Even if it's, like, not a normal thing you want to check out. Um, I've always recommended I had somebody that I met the other day. When I, got the kid, I brought the kids to a trampoline park. And they were, like, a foreign exchange student. But they were here after high school. They were doing, like, a college transition to schooling here on, like, a visa. And working with a family and stuff. And it was super cool. They were all interested. Like, where do you want to go? Or, like, if I was going to go and see... Uh, some historic landmarks or something. They were asking me about it, and I was like, yeah, definitely check out if you got the chance to go between here and Oregon. I told them, like, the Columbia Gorge is really beautiful, and then um, pretty much uh, I told them about, let's see, the east coast of Washington, or not east coast, but east side of Washington has uh, a few other really neat landmarks that seemed like they were all created from the volcano flows. Um, so we have, like, the Palouse is what it's called, and then there's another like a secret spot out among this weird rolling hills like we produce a lot of hay here in eastern washington uh and wheat so wheat is like i think the primary we're either number two in producing wheat or something around here but like we have a lot of wheat fields and so they do on the central plains and stuff too but we like produce a lot and we send it all out and export it too but um so through the rolling hills there's a place called the palouse falls and that's actually technically close to where I was able to go to college in eastern Washington here. Um, but if you're very curious, you know, check it out. There's some neat, some neat landmarks. Uh, Palouse Falls is like river flowing along, river flowing along. And then among these like rolling hills, you come to this huge pit. And the earth had just literally sunk in and, and eroded away. And a waterfall exists that like blooms down like 150 feet. Just rolling hills not a lot of depth a huge drop and the water like was cracked into the earth and it's like really neat but uh they actually i think they shut it down for tourism for like a year because somebody jumped off there and technically died so that's never good but uh yeah um side note we went there when there wasn't that many people going and it was it was pretty neat yeah yeah it's one of those things where it's like if you can ever uh you know, imagine things that don't seem like they would exist where we're at. Cool to check out. I have a couple of acquaintances that used to live up there a good 30 years or so. Oh, years back. Nice. And they used to mushroom hunt up there. Yeah, the woods are known for that here and in Oregon. 
technically. Like the western coast side has a lot of that. The pictures they had were insane with how big some of them. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, for the 30 years back. They, they've been, yeah, pretty big about that. Elena, did he do anything to you? Yes, yeah, so Ryoto kept his hands to himself, though he did see fit to share his foul mouth. <laughs> Come, we must begin the ceremony. Uh, I feel like they're going to hear screeching, and then I'm going to have to go in and save the trials of the temple here. Hey, yo, what's up, Raven? We just got back into the, uh, the finishing escort mission here for our geo catcher friend. Man, how long is this going to take? We've been waiting for, like, hours. Oh, stop your whining. This is part of the job. His wise eagle friend here. Bit talk. Man, what are they doing in there? This is why I hate church. Everything takes forever. You love Grandia. Uh, have you you played the second one then, right? Did you have this on Dreamcast too back in the day, Raven? Appreciate you popping in. I know you were voted. You well, you voted this as what you wanted. I think you might have even popped in the Discord to vote. I saw somebody vote for that. So uh, this and Fantasy Star Online got some votes from the Discord side. So I'm planning on playing. Um, those for the brief that I can. Oh yeah, you had it. Nice. What's eating you, Ryoto? Thinking about that singing schoolgirl? I just got a bad feeling about this. It's okay, Han Solo. Hey, what's up, Evie? How are you doing tonight? Or this afternoon for folks that might just be further ahead in time. Hope Monday treats those well that are, uh, I'd say, over the pond, too. Nice, though. In this tower, too. Don't you think it looks like a strange place for a holy ceremony? Our protagonist, I'm, I'm thinking, has more like a Gary, like an annoying Gary tone. Check out the mural. What's the deal with these weird wings? Uh, looks like a dragon. I'm good. Good to hear. Yeah, uh, we're doing all right for this weekend. I'm like in the busiest middle portion of it. I did some outside yard work. Um, just getting some planters and stuff ready. We found some cheap, uh set of like a bunch of uh, perennials and things to plant in uh, these big half wine barrels we were managing to uh, source out about a month ago we, we ended up getting them I think and then we just recently were like okay I think we plotted out how we're going to arrange it but today was the day to work on it without too much weather Skrilp appears your favorite Pokemon episode were the ones that Gary got his butt handed to him <laughs> I'm waiting for those moments too an ancient ruin I figure it dates from the silvery white light age Silvery, not the Bronze Age, but the silvery white light. That sounds like uh, the European Christian Holy Wars or something. <laughs> Blue, you love the emotes. Blue sky, blue and friends. I thank you all for being here. I mean, the battle of good and evil. Why would they do their exorcisms or whatever in a place like this? We're working on my Gary tone. Uh oh, here in the uh, screeches of. Flashes of blue light. Hey, where are you going? On these guys, you have to sound like Rayudo after a little bit, right? Something funny's going on. Let's check it out. Didn't they say not to go in? Dude, this beat just freaking carries hard, right? Look, if anything happens to that Elena chick, it's my rep on the line, and I'm not gonna blow this job. True enough, and this is out of the ordinary. Quit stalling, let's go! Smell you later, Gramps! It's so, like... Garment Tower. I feel like there will be save points along the way of the tower, maybe. Nice catch, Irem. GG's. Huh? Great. Just great. Where did all these jam monsters come from? Careful, Ryoto. Okay, wall monsters I can maybe surprise. Ch -ch 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 -ch. Love Fillion's emotes. I s oh, use them all the time. Yeah, I understand that. Is he a poison attack me or something? They're really building up here. Oh, snap. I got two hits in. Perfect. And a coin! Honestly, for Dreamcast, this game got some decent graphics. Where RPGs in this area just recruited the most insane musicians. Oh, definitely. Thinking the same Iron Guy headphones on was like, Whoa! 
takes off. Hey, old friends, will be lurking, no worries. I will definitely holler if I definitely appreciate you popping in, too. I'll holler if I need anything. Uh, this won't be a very long stream, so maybe I'll catch you on the flippy flop, too. Did I have an option to guard there? I think I must have. Yeah. I think I was like, I was always pushing A or something. It, uh, it acted like I had a moment to guard, which is cool. Um... The only one I could think that is like similar to this. Oh, cool! You can just kind of run past. Really, with the bump jump, I can move. Oh, You can just straight dodge them, but I think I just got a back attack. You were surprised! Alright, pass them up on the second, go. I think like the two hits is working on this cycle, though. Maybe 20 minutes left until I'm out of mobile data. Oh, you're using it for me? Thank you, though. Blue, I appreciate you. Uh, I know you were busy saying you're out, and of course the weekend is going to be busy for most, so. Thanks for popping in. I appreciate you all. Oh, I have an issue. We're just attacking away. We got some medicinal herbage and whatever else we need. Combo! Oh. Initiative work. Yeah, appreciate it. Honestly, I think I watched one other person stream this over the last week or so, and uh... Hand grenade. Oh, the holy hand grenade. There we go. Thanks for choosing me to be a spot to hang uh, for the weekend here. It is uh, a top plan. I don't like that. I had a late reaction, I could guard, but the guard was successful. Depends on the hit timing. You better practice if you want to beat me. Practice if you want to beat me. See, he's like, smell you later. Should just try to repeat his lines, but like wear the, the meme shades. I just jump off the table, like, there I go. So, like, there's libraries and stuff, and it feels like those little library shelves can move, maybe? I don't know. Let's try to get people to play Grandia 2 all the time. Oh, we should definitely DM that, uh, we're hard at it. I, I, I don't know if they made this version for PS2. I feel like they did. I need to learn if there's an actual block timing to that or not. Yeah. You better practice if you want to beat me. Here, let me try his line again. You better practice if you want to beat me. <laughs> we won't hear that enough. Second floor, here we go. <laughs> It's like the camera automatically starts off in the worst possible angle. Made basically every Dreamcast game worth playing. Oh yeah, for PS2. That makes sense. Honestly, the ports were pretty strong, and the competition because most of the era of RPGs was just really popular. Especially JRPGs. If he goes... Knock knock, what's up Roger? How you doing tonight? Few exceptions of course. Yeah, I mean like Sega, like region lock ones or Japanese, like specific ones that didn't get a good port maybe. Like I know a lot of um titles that were just not selling well enough, so then of course they didn't they didn't jump over to the newer consoles. 
but the, the age of RPGs run strong, isn't it? Well, this place is easy enough to get lost in, huh? But I'm just acquired. Playing the camera is just good old retro gaming. Yeah. <laughs> Deals like it. How's everybody's weekend, though? Overall, yeah. hope they get to take care of, you know, selves, fam, anybody in your inner circle. Most of all, you know, you. Hey, hydrated, right? Just if you want to beat me. <laughs> I don't know, who knows? Maybe if we level up, we get more health out of it. Take the initiative. I don't think it's Sami. Yes. Seems like with the initiative, you literally can get two attacks in before they get their attacks. Unless, I mean, that little bird enemy looks free. Oh, this is like a gargoyle. Alright, they got some plans. Insight and slash! As they try to howl at me. Oh. Ow! That did some damage. Not gonna lie. I'd like to take out this enemy. Ten say can slash. Two seventy six and boom, get some gold out of there. Let me I mean, heal after that though. Is this just like a dead end with a bunch of- oh no, it opens up. Okay. Hate him. 400 heal. Alright. Revive- oh, we got two revives in here tonight. Uh, why is Slayer still on this easy game? Yo, Shinfi! Actually, we this is the second time we've even played it. Yeah. On stream. But we're trying some Dreamcast. How are you doing tonight? Yeah, if I wasn't stuck in this dungeon for the longer... Who knows? I heard critical. Baby. We're, uh, we're trying to move. Yeah, no. Oh, bless you. Enough to wipe it. You better practice if you want to beat me. This is Slayer came down a little bit. Swapping the camera out, I guess. But yeah, we have this on the Dreamcast. What is your guys' favorite RPG stylings, I guess? Of, uh, what, 2000s? initiative on this little spider looking creature. It's like a ant on steroids, but I mean, it has to be a spider, right? You got the uh, eight-legged termite feet. Oh yeah. You better practice if you want to beat me. Guys of Arcadia is pretty killer. Yeah, that was my other vote. Uh, the first disc to it Oh, nice, we leveled up. The first disc to it that I have might be too far gone. It had some pretty deep scratches. And uh, it only ever booted up once, like, half the intro. I was a little worried about that. We've done a full loop now. That was the inner circle crap. We've got to get all the way to the other side. Figure out if we can make it. I think there's some... Okay. Places that we'd like to explore, but haven't been able to get through. Save points I like. Okay, perfect. Recover freely here. And a green stars of... The Skies of Arcadia in a boss game. Is the DC version or GameCube version? I remember had the GameCube one. So this save officially... Um, Alright, that being the fast track to get out of here. We just, we're taking shortcuts and cut through the middle after that. 
Well, I guess if I was playing this as not my first time playthrough, I probably would have known exactly where to go. Well, could beat it on GameCube, but also played briefly on Dreamcast. Nice. Uh, I should look into the GameCube first. I'm sure it's super expensive to find now. But I do remember trying to play that one. And what's another Tales of something? Was it Tales of, uh... Not Fantasia. There was a Tales game that was really good on, um... GameCube as well. Oh, we gotta fight Goodies. Save it. Howdy! What's up, Wedgie? How you doing tonight? Cool, cool. I heard the random encounters on the Dreamcast version was a lot higher, but that's about it. Tales of Destiny. At that might be. I cannot remember for the life of me. What happens if we build up the attack here? Symphonia. Yeah, I think that was the one. Symphonia. And then, um. GameCube side. Okay, so it definitely takes an extra hit. Missed. Okay, it'll move further away out there. Yeah. Okay, being fully healed, now I feel overwhelmed for this fight. I, uh, have been working on public space stuff on YouTube, and it's really neat that it's playing out a little bit. You cast and counter rate, you required you to get, and abuse the counter rate accessory at the time. Uh, I get it makes sense. Some of the, uh, Oh, they're gonna get their hit in, but I got mine first. That's cool. Even though they're initiating the hit, it canceled theirs. Even though they're initiating the hit, it takes in a time like me. like a real-time battle system, so they had to move physically far enough towards me before their hit would actually uh, engage. And we got the win. What happened? The ceremony failed. Oh, she's all bloodied up. Failed. Save Elena. Hang on, we'll get you out of here. Damn it. She's dead. Rude. No time for sentiment. Jeez. Oh, you think mobile internet is crying at you right now? Hey, see you, uh, Blue. Appreciate you popping in. Now, have a great night. And anybody even just lurking, I appreciate y'all. We're not going to be going super late anyway. I have like an hour left up at the most for the stream. Search for the others, says our bird friend Sky. Yeah, we're way steep here. Well, that sucks. Uh, is there a window to jump out of? Go find the others, huh? Girl is. What's going on? Damn it! Where are the rest of them? What the hell is going on? Through the doors, I meant. Look with the catch, a minior blue. Minior? Oh, there we go. Good timing for the blue. I don't know if I across that one. I'm gonna try for it. This stupid door doesn't budge. The red dots there. I'll look for another way in. Damn. So he's got like the I got a bad feeling about this Han Solo, and then he's a straight like Rayo, this window. One of those. Resident Evil bust through the window things. Ah. Nice. Wow, holy! Yo, 34 bucks. What is that? Man. Dude. Modern Thank you so much for the months! Subscribe. Holy crap, Thank it's almost so three much years. That is... Happy 34 months. I'd still, I'm still conjuring up, like, how long we possibly be affiliated here. The support, oh, it looks like they are, like, taken in with this strange evil energy. We're playing Grandia 2, uh, huge shout out to Matt. I don't know if you were planning on streaming after your, of course, long, uh, weekend. But thank you for the support, man. You're all legends here, and I, I, I don't deserve it. But thank you for that anyway, through uh, through all the ups and downs for stream inside. Darkness! I know that! Darkness! Um... Yo, huge shout out to Matt. Uh, do I, do I, what do I owe the pleasure? Would you like, would you like spicy chip and a half? Got some ready with the, uh... Looks like I'm back over to some green jalapeno sauce. Some dabity dab jalapeno. Rick, Rick. Rick's on the bottle. Who says? 
I'm saying Rick like it's Rick talking about Rick. Not, not another Rick. Morty. Oh, there is no darkness inside me. You cannot. I forbid you. Ah! Um, how's the night going for everybody? I appreciate you popping in. I'll, I'll do yourself just a little, a little dab here. A little pre-work jalapeno dab. Spice it up. I got a uh, drink of choice tonight. A little rum and coke to lighten it up. Go oh, jalapeno. It's in. It's in the hatch. Woo. Ray Yoda, you there? Snap out of it. I appreciate you, man. That That's a crazy amount of months. And uh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Damn it. I'm going to save her. Music intensifies. Oh. Wow, there was something dark going on here in this orb. I feel like he's jumping portals or something. Hey, if you stick around and you're around tonight, I'm going to try for Sonic Adventure 2. Wait, the, the weather has calmed down. The Sky Safari can continue. We both caught that, by the way, uh, the Minior. Toyota, we've got trouble. We'll be playing this as a demo version of Sonic Adventure 2 on um, Dreamcast real soon, and then, uh, whew. And then, um, Fantasy Star Online to wrap up the night, just kind of mix up what we have. Looks like we're on a mission. Escape via zip line, because thank goodness that was there. Nothing like an action-packed RPG that it sticks a getaway. 60 months? No, me? What? Thank you so much for the 16th. Holy crap, you guys are gonna, on a prime sub, you guys are gonna kick off a, a hype train if I'm not looking away for two seconds. Thank you so much for the, the support. Are cool. 16 months. Nerdy. Woo. Shout out to Nerdy too, friends. They're an awesome streamer. They have also been busy playing Palia. If you ever want to check out a neat chill game, it kind of has a open world vibe, definitely give them a follow. Thank you for the 16 months. Do I owe you another spicy bit? Uh, I would at least take another drink in between, or I'm gonna fry myself. Um, I got some other games on the agenda, too, so we'll see if we can go past this and save a bit. Anyway, she looks alright. Let's head back to the town as soon as possible. Say, are you feeling okay? You were acting a little strange back there in the tower. Yeah, just some bad memories. Oh, hey, she's waking up. I appreciate y'all. Thank you so much for the 16 months. It seems like it goes way fast. And Nerdy, I know you've got your own sound alert dedicated now uh, to anybody who hits 16 months or near it. Uh, I'm trying to dedicate more sound alert spots to you, fam, that uh, are well-deserving for any kind of support like that. Thank you for even subbing for half the time we've been affiliated here. Or if you've known us since we've literally kicked off that affiliate status, it means a lot, though. Thanks for the support. Uh, hey, wake up! Oh, stop it. Stop it. So she was like under control, right? Yeah, like an evil entity going on there. Hey, it's all right now. Oh, hey. Marshmallow, how'd you get your name? There you go. if you show me a sweet potato pie, I <laughs> am on top of it. I knew it. <laughs> marshmallow pie. He's a marshmallow on top of the sweet potato pie. Where am I? In the woods, near that tower. Hey, Bong, thank you for the lurks. Appreciate you. See you. And appreciate it. Looks like that sound alert was delayed a minute. I'm not sure if it just stacked in because of the other sound alert, but I do see it. So let me see if it's going to play. Oh, it's Chica, but it's still lurking. Thanks, Chica, for the alerts. No worries. Day. If anybody has some cool plans, you know, no worries, if you are busy, I totally get it. It is late as well for East Coast time. Look over there, like midnight. Those are sweet potatoes, the best sweet potatoes. I'm not gonna lie, I've, I've recently got turned on to uh, air frying like sweet potato fries, and it might be my new favorite type of fry, if it's, if it's done right. You know, a little salt, extra kind of long air fried, it's a good time. Um, Next to, like, curly fries, if, you know, you like the, the, the fried up, like, a little more crunchy or so, it just depends on the 
bit of a surprise for sure. Heck yeah. Yeah, we actually originally like did our own uh, like crinkle cut, kind of cut up some potatoes, but we didn't have sweet potatoes. We tried the original ones because our kids love those. That is the power of darkness. Where is everyone? Where is Tessa? Uh, bad news, she passed. You were the only survivor. Sorry. Come on, we've got to get moving. Ah, that's a lot to report back to town with. No! I am... Is... Is everyone... Everyone... I am going back! They must have... No, they... They got rocked by the, the evil spirits there. Hey, hey, princess! Power of Darkness isn't coming this way to tell us about the neighborhood bake sale! We need to leave! <laughs> Are they really gone? Oh my goodness, the, uh, the, the dialogue. Yeah, they're dead. You nearly didn't make it yourself. You weren't looking so hot. Never mind those wings you sprouted. I make a sweet potato stew, all with garbanzo beans and chicken. That, that does sound really good. Yeah, nice. Slice the potatoes up, coat them in olive oil before roasting them, and then put them in. Nice. Now you've got us all wondering if you ever make something like that and you wanted to share it in the Discord. Ever feel like you have to. But if you wanted to share it, we've got like a food porn, mm, like just gonna say nom nom um, spot. Anybody that is, of course, one of share some fun baked stuff or some if you have a recipe that you're like this was just bomb um yeah always open to share not that you have to, but if it's your special family secret recipe that's fair too we lost to the power of darkness to the power of bomar oh you still with us songstress hey time to snap out of it the dead won't be joining us anytime soon so he reminds me of like Holland Solo, and she could be like Princess Leia in this venture, I guess. The ceremony has failed. All have perished. Why should I alone have lived? Why should I alone keep living? Because I've got a job to do. Now get up and get your butt in gear. I'll play with you some other time. You, you monster. You cold, unfeeling brute. So, uh, the play with you some other time. Isn't that Sonic? We are going to try some Sonic soon. Geohound. Cold, unfeeling Geohound. Excuse me. Reminding them. <laughs> uh, but that's awesome, Iron. Nice. And I'm glad you like the song, Evie. I appreciate anybody who's still here or even lurking. I uh, hope the, uh, the uh, evening or going to be Monday Memorial Day time. I appreciate this character. He doesn't take any guff or drama. Right. Just kind of brushes it off. Let's keep going. Keep going with the story. Kind of reminds me of like, Final Fantasy IX. Kind of has that, like, like I'm just going to not care what people think, you know? And then eventually it's like, once they have a love interest, and say everything changes, but... It's like we escape. I don't think they'll follow us this far. Well, calm down a bit. Hmm. Anyway, I'll bring you back to the priest. That's what I was hired for, after all. Yeah, I mean, like, that's classic. 90s to 2000s. Just, like, hero mode guy. Ryodu, how can you kill so indiscriminately? <laughs> I mean, it save her. I'm sorry, you are doing it to protect me. It's like there was monsters, so we're just doing the job, right? Yeah, don't worry. Part of the job. I feel like the softness of the character is going gonna to get to him, and then he's going to eventually want to go on this adventure to continue to uh, work with them. Carbo, is, I, let's save it briefly. And then find the priest, I imagine, is the way to go. Elena, something wrong? You look pale. Uh, well, you know, uh, we had a bit of a running in with some evil. And then, uh, our friend's sisters died. But yeah, uh, we're, we're getting into the story a bit. I hope everybody is, uh, enjoying it, maybe thus far. Sonic Adventure 2. I've never played the original hardware version, so I'm hoping the demo disc works fine. Um... You guys get to be the first, you know, first folks to see. Uh, it's part of the Fantasy Star, like, online Sega Dreamcast one. I, demo, I demoed that a little bit. I don't think I played it past the intro screen, but I did get to see the character selection mode and everything. Father Curious, Elena, are you the only one to make it back? Where are the others? What has happened? During the ceremony... Uh, they all died. Oh, child, you have said enough for now. Rest and speak on these things later time. Okay. I, I didn't catch all the dialogue. I don't know if we can rewind and see it again. 
But anyway, my job here is done. You paid me enough. I wasn't exactly the most successful bodyguard. He's gonna blame himself for the other deaths, huh? But what the hell was that ceremony about? Mr. Ryoto, you must be tired. We shall prepare some warm food for you. Come, please. Come inside. Lena, you as well. I mean, an interesting little, like, a little Catholic heavy town. It reminds me, like, Dragon Quest, uh, through Dragon Quest, like, 8 is the one I'm most familiar with. Kind of has that vibe, but a little more, like, Japanese anime characters going. Um, Dragon Quest has always had pretty unique art. It always felt like a Ghibli, uh, film, you know, the design of the characters and the storyline's great. Can't tell you much about the ceremony, but the last I saw, because I think Shigeru, Shigeru Mito, Miyamoto, maybe, was the designer, or is that the Mario guy? I forget. Who was the one that... Yeah, Miyamoto's the Mario guy. Who was the one that passed away recently? Because they were the ones, I think, that helped design the Dragon Quest characters. Same with... Same character, or the creator from DBZ. Toriyama, yeah. Sorry, I had Ed Mario's back story character in my head. Uh, Toriyama, yeah, was the... Was the original character creation. Drawing up, design, all the art for them. I can't tell you much about the ceremony, but the last I saw, and this sounds odd, Elena had grown these black wings. Anyway, we cut out of there pretty damn fast. You ain't pulling punches either. This is a rated teen, teen game back in 2000. They definitely had some uh, some cussing dialogue, so I hope y'all are cool with it. Father, I, I had wings. Wings. Hush now, Elena. You are tired. Go to your room and get some rest. I mean, they're both aware that they had this happen. And I think he's gonna deny it, lay it down like it was nothing, huh? Go to your room, get some rest, understood. Yes, father. I mean, I think the darkness within kind of thing, and he's just like, no, we don't talk about this. That's very classic, uh, <laughs> hush, hush, so we don't, we don't speak ill. The religion will save us. Oh, man. So the ceremony was a failure, and Elena, possessed by the wings. Uh, see, but he knows, like, he knows, it's just not... <laughs> not gonna disclose it to her, I guess. Freeze reminds me of one in uh, Rogue Galaxy. Yeah! See, what's funny is, I don't remember all of the storyline from that, but I do remember the, the play on the early stuff in it. Uh, Zangoose appears. Good luck with the catch. You mind filling me in, Chief? Try finishing your sentences? I knew it would be dangerous, yet, even so, we had to do it. The wings had to be sealed. The wings of Balmar, Ryoto, the wings of darkness. What? As Granus is the god of light, so Valmar is the devil of darkness. Long ago, the two met in battle, as was ordained. The battle between good and evil, right? Everyone knows the fairy tale. Valmar was defeated, yes, but not destroyed. Even now, the Foul One prepares for the coming of eternal night. Wow, the battle of the little darkness here, they never fully sealed him away. This is new. Uh, let me check if I've got that one before. Zangoose, I guess I have. Valmar grows in power with each passing day, seeking to break the seals which, for a time, have kept the darkness bound. As is foretold in scripture, the day of darkness is at hand. The world groans with the heaviness of Valmar's rebirth. The devil seeks again to blot out the light of Granus. Valmar will return our will return our world to darkness and destroy it. That was a good trait. You got a comb bee for your magic carp. Nice win. <laughs> nice. I'm guessing you have multiple magic carp too. Never would I probably come across a Gyarados, except for maybe I got real lucky and catch, like, a basic one. What? I think a uh, shiny one would be dope. Sadly, even the power of our Pope, Zera Innocentius, <laughs> is not enough to ward seals against the very darkness itself. Is he innocent, their Pope? Yet it is the work of myself and my brethren to prevent the advent of that day when all light shall fade away. Almost lyrical. Alright, Priest, let's see. Yep, trade your dupes. Yeah, that's a fair move. Were it not so, I would not have sent my daughter to that doomed ceremony. Your daughter? Tessa? Oh, the sealing ceremony failed. And if what you say is true, not only did it fail, but Elena has become possessed by Valmar's cursed wings as well. What happens next? Pieces of Valmar devour the soul of those they possessed. Our dear Elena, once she is emptied the wings will move on what that sounds vampirish 
On to another host. This is how Valmar feeds, gathering strength to re-enter our world. Fetters will be loosed. That's awful. Ryoto, will you lend us your services again? We need a uh, exorcism of a different kind, huh? Will you help Elena be your bodyguard? Huh? These sad events may yet be made to work in our favor. I wish to send Elena to Gratis Cathedral immediately. It is rumored that His Holiness Zara knows of an ancient sacrament which has the power to cleanse the soul of darkness. The right would free Elena and shield others from the taint of evil. We may again be able to seal the wings away. Hmm. Such an act would delay Valmar's return. However, those that follow darkness will not sit idly as our plans come to fruition. Big storyline here. I'm sorry, were you waiting for me to give a damn? <laughs> No, Ryoto, I wait for you to recognize an opportunity. For your services, you shall receive, say, a statue of gold? Belong to the church, but needs outweigh vanity. I believe it would make a, pre a pretty enough prize. Let me think about it. Where can we go in your wisdom? <laughs> what was that? Something outside? I skipped ahead pretty quick on the dialogue. I love the, I love the like, Han Solo mode. Are you waiting for me to give a damn? <laughs> Excuse me, I forget the part where that's my problem. He's like, Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man meets Han Solo right now to me. <laughs> so good. Now we got dialogue, voiceovers back. So filled with power. Millennia. Oh, I Hiya, Bugs, excellent. how are you doing tonight? What? Th that girl did Was I this? anywhere close to his actual what voice? What have you done? You foul dark one! I could go a little more heavy on his dark. Wow, he's a I not dark deep tone. What do you think you're doing, huh? Huh? What do you mean by dark one? Is it coming through huh. alright, yo? She has a fair hand with magic. Yeah, we're playing uh, Grandia 2 on the OG Dreamcast. I'm doing alright. We I still work tonight uh, in a short and bit. But uh, scamming out, having a tail end of some Coca-Cola, rum and coke. Like a dark one to you. <laughs> Mm. I mean, really? Ryuto, beware! Very Tenshi Muyo. Yeah, it has an interesting flow. Evil I almost think like forms far the bosses profile. from Pokemon's character. Are you really one of the dark ones? Oh, the extra huh? tones with the. the Ooh, just the yeah, sight of this place speaking. disgusts me. This filthy statue, <laughs> this church, and the scum who live here too. Oh, it's wild, yeah. But yeah, yeah, we're we're hanging. Uh, for what? Sunday. We just became best friends. Yeah. Oh, what are you doing? Thank you, Bugs. Appreciate the gifty Careful over to you, Iron. Now she's dangerous. Thank you so much for the support. Um, I'll give you a shout out too while we're busy with this. Uh, you originally worked tonight, Bug. Uh, oh, you called what out. Oh, okay. So I understand that. Um. Well, I hope you still get a free er Monday. <laughs> Didn't have patience anyway, so they were going to call me off, so it worked out. Oh, it was a trade off. Okay. Well, I hope you're feeling it. Call out. Hey, what do you think you're doing? I understand there's lots of different reasons. I, I out of your don't mind? feel like working. Or are you like, just as sick and twisted as you are? The whole entire look. weekend, but I, I'm going to put the extra shifts in where I can, and going into Monday, I'll get a little bit of overtime for the holiday this weekend, so I'll, I'll take it. I thought you. It's one of those trade offs. But thank you so much for the gifty. Um, I owe anybody that has been gifting some over here either a uh, 15 minutes of extended game of their choice. Oh, we got a fight on our hands. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Luckily, it pauses when I need to do an attack in here. We can take one simple chip, and if you would like, I can spice it up with habanero or a combination uh, tabanero, which is a Tabasco habanero. You're the third elder subby of the night. Thank you for the for the sub support. Appreciate that. Thank you back. Even if it was just one of those pay it forward things, I know we were talking the other night about like, oh, you didn't need to, or you were gonna do it anyway, but oh snap, quick on the attack. For 80 damage. I like habanero, nice. I'll give you the habanero. Uh, I'm Mr. Meeseeks. I can slash. I can slash. I don't think we hurt the health bar on that one. I have a bad feeling about this. And maybe we gotta do enough damage to, like, break them down? Yeah. Do a little dabby.
Ram. Oh no. Lowered my attack, maybe? Woo! That was a good amount. I'll just try all the different attacks I can do. Zap. Wait. I'm, like, countering my current attack? That does not look good. This seems like a much bigger attack than I was perceiving. Here. Oh, golly. I just got knocked on my butt. Paralyzed. What the heck? It's on the congrats. <laughs> Don't toy with me! I have not seen that one come up, like, My name is Millennia. Fine. Fine, friends. Yeah, what? I'll be back. I like you, my name is Millennia, and she's flirting with me. Also, five chips tonight. Five chips. Alternatively, yeah. Thank you for, uh, about a thousand bit support. You all are too kind. I'm gonna line up the other five Father, sauces that you I'll probably you haven't seen in a minute. I want to find out for myself. We'll start with the red pepper hot sauce and work our way up like it's a dab. On. But yeah, I'll show you on the little screen here. We got we got Morty, the red pepper the red pepper hot sauce guy here. I'll actually make the camera even bigger for a second. And then we're gonna be switching it up to, uh, believe it or not, Sonic Adventure Two. Sonic Adventure Two soon. Um, so we just did Habanero. We're gonna end with Diablo, the Diablo one. That this is my my brother gifted me these back. I'm like, uh, I think it was around Christmas time. Rayota, are you fine with this? Didn't you say that you don't like getting involved in matters of religion? Um, we did Jalapeno earlier, and I actually have more upstairs, but I have at least five available to do um, this many. So look, we'll go we'll go down the line. We'll do all, we'll do all five. Thank you for the thousand support. Uh, whew. He said, I'll get to meet that Pope Zera at the cathedral. Think about it, Sky. The Pope. We can get in good with him. We can get our hands on some ungodly amounts of loot. I'm not a newly hatched chick, Ryoto. I suspect you have other reasons for your broad change of heart. Um, yes, maybe. All right, first dab. Goes out to Layden Bugs. Woo. The last dab. We'll also go out to Layden Bugs. Thank you for the support. Thank you for the thousand bits. Too kind. Because bits, even though the exchange rate's not great, bits support the channel directly with that amount, so I appreciate that. You didn't have to, but you sure did. All right, we'll do jalapeno next. And then, uh, again, if you're okay with me saving it at this point, switch it up and we'll try Sonic Adventure 2. Oh, uh, there's a demo. That I'm actually excited to play the cap back on these before I get too far ahead. No, what I was saying for the exchange rate, uh, bits technically are like a direct, so the amount of bit that you end up anybody ends up paying for, that that supports that exact dollar amount. You know, bits are like each penny matches that way, but the exchange rate isn't perfect. Uh, I only get half of subs. I only get half of subs, so I thank you. And then prime subs are, I think, even a small portion less. Jalapeno. Jalapeno's Morty. Just kidding, that's Rick. My brother knew I liked Rick and Morty back in the day. He just happened to find this at like one of those, uh, one of those Amazon like cheap bundle deals. Jalapeno. It's a little green, a little different. Not bad though. Here's the other uh, full habanero one again. Yeah, bits technically are like, I guess the best version, even though like stars on Facebook gaming had a better exchange rate, I guess I should say. It's good, it's good. It's building up in spice though. To end with Tabasco Nero, Tabanero. Little, little chip, little chip, big flavor. 
And that sauce uh, looks like this. I actually found that at uh, Walmart. Tabasco Nero. Tabasco Nero. And Diablo, which is a, it does have a pretty good kick to it. Diablo's like a... Supposed to be like ghost pepper habanero, something like that. Mr. Ryoto, sorry to keep you waiting. Here's your money. How did he know I wanted the money when he got here? Ooh, big dab. Almost dro almost dropped it. Gold statue acquired. Dang. That's gonna have a huge exchange rate. But never feel like you have to, friends. I thank you for the support. Woo! The chip dust alone of the spicy flaming hot limon. <laughs> Not to be gold plated. Yeah, it's probably just made of like copper. Thank you for your help. Shall we go? I mean, even if it was copper, it'd be worth a lot, but, like, it's a stone statue with a little bit of gold plating. Brana's Cathedral is a bit of a hike. Princess, better leave your silk slippers behind. You sure you're up to this? I must go. You don't want the others to have died in vain. All right, we'll move this back up here so you guys can see what's left of the gammon. Botching my my overlay here. Boop 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 boop. Mm, 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 mm. That's so spicy. But yeah, thank you for the thank you for the support. Regardless, I uh, hope the evening goes well for all of you. Whew, taking a moment to catch my breath. We'll go from Grandia 2 to uh, eventually Fantasy Star, I think. I was voted by Blue, actually, but I think he had to dip out for a minute. Very well, Father, please take care. And that minute would be... I was, uh, he was here hanging out with some mobile data while they were busy this weekend and kind of ran out of uh, service where they're at. Elena, be careful during your travels. I shall pray for your safety. And I'll pray for the patience I'm going to need. <laughs> I will not be a burden. I am quite able to fend for myself. So the songstress has spunk. Good. Let's move. I must get to Granus Cathedral, no matter the cost. A wild Zubat appears. A little flying Pokemon. Coming in with the wings, I guess. I will try for a catch. Maybe it's a special breed. Okay, so, Miss Elena, our fare is simple, but we have prepared our table for you. Please, make yourself at home. We recover, and then save it. I'm guessing it's like night, so we're supposed to rest before we continue our quest. Um, we, we got another hour or so into this game, and I've only got about half an hour left before I got to bounce tonight, so... Again, check out where we're at. Um, please make yourself at home. And, uh... Meaning I will switch games for a brief bit. Staying here tonight. Come on, let's eat, Elena. Wait, it's like a mini game. So, Ryoto, what do you say we finish this meal? Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm almost... Ooh, okay, then. Tomorrow I start my babysitting job with the princess. I better get my rest. Ooh, okay... Well, I never. Bro. Oh. Talking to the table, little table talk. Hope you'll burn. All right. Uh, but yeah, I did alternatively have a uh, toxic waste bean spinner, and uh, we used all of those over the course of the summer into uh, the end of the year last year. Forgot to update some of those higher cost ones, but see, so yeah, I still have the little spinner from the sixth edition bean boozled one. Eventually, I might um, look into activating something like that again. But all right, we we did that little cutscene. Let's uh, save it over what we just did. I would make a secondary slot, maybe as just a fun backup in case the memory fails or something. You never know. Um, 